let's go through kind of the day in the life of a, a tool designer. I'm gonna go and I'm gonna create a document. And this is how we start out in Onshape. And let's just call it like Friday. Onshape creates what's called a part studio. And a part studio is really kind of a holder of information. Uh, we can create geometry here. So here I have all the commands for creating solid modeling, parametric geometry, it's multi-body, as we'll see. There's an area over here for working uh, kind of direct or, or working with non-parametric data. So it's kind of direct editing. I can, you know, remove services, uh, do feature recognition, things like that. Sheet metal capabilities. And then there's um, a library of different user-defined features. And uh, I kind of use or make use of those too uh, fairly frequently. But we're going to focus on kind of the core capabilities. Um, as I mentioned, we can create uh, components and parts here. I can create assemblies. Um, I can go in and create drawings. I can import information. And that's one of the things I'm going to do here. Uh, what we're going to do is say, you know, we get some information from the engineering group and they want us to build uh, or work with this particular component. So I got to build some fixturing and, and tooling for it. So I'm going to say, let's go and import in that information. So they're working with SolidWorks. So here's a SolidWorks file. That I'm going to import. So I'll say, let's just bring that in to Onshape. And Onshape is going to pop up a window here to showing me that it's uploaded this. And again, this could be any file, right? This could be from Katia or NX or Creo or Step or Rigis or, or whatever. And oh, and so it's brought it in. Um, I'm going to go over here, take a look at our, and we'll let's get rid of this guy. I don't really need that empty part, but here's the one that it brought in. So here's our component brought in from SolidWorks. And so this is the part that we're going to be uh, working with from a manufacturing standpoint. So I'm going to turn off the planes here for a minute. So the first thing that we want to do when we see a component is we kind of want to get together and figure out exactly, you know, how should we approach this? Uh, what types of things should we be thinking about? Uh, there's also, uh, as I mentioned before, this part studio is a holder of information. I, as I said, you know, we have our part here. I can have drawings and things like that. I could also come in here and say, let's bring in some other information and maybe uh, let's bring in some material specifications for this, or maybe bring in some images or movies or, or anything that helps us better understand what we're working with. So here I've got that material specification is brought in. And again, you notice it's all here in my part studio, sort of one place where I can get all the information that I need for this particular component. 